Hey guys, Rivet here. Welcome back to another episode of Cube World back with season seven. Is that right? Seven? Yes, yeah, seven with Kit and what the? Our lovely warrior, shield warrior, shield maiden, I guess. If you want to call him that, doesn't matter. So hope everyone is enjoying themselves. Happy Sunday to everybody. Um, today I'm recording this just a day in advance. I'm recording on Saturday because I'm working Sunday. Um, my vacation is officially over. I am no longer free to do the things I'd like to do and do all the streams and all the things because I have been doing a lot of that if you guys have been paying attention over on Twitch. Um, yesterday for me, oh God, here we go, we're going to wreck some fools. Or we're not, we're going to go wreck this, this is the thing. Iron deposit, piss us off. Hey, you guys can just chill. I'm going to go get the owl, oh god, of course. Um, yesterday, which for me was Friday for you guys, uh, two days ago, I guess. Um, was my son's birthday uh, so we uh, we got together we played a little bit of video games together hung out and had a blast it was a lot of fun uh, ended up streaming overall on Friday about six hours or so did four different streams a um, lot of fun uh, you guys will see starting tomorrow on the channel Uncharted 4 which I picked up last week and uh, played the whole thing on stream uh, finished to end, uh, beginning to end, sorry. I did it in five days, I think it was, something like that, which is uncommon for me. I never usually get sucked into a game that much, and that game just kind of drew me in, and I loved every second of it. Uh, so much so that I'm actually planning on going back and playing it again at a harder difficulty just for myself, because um, it's just one of those rare games that the story was amazing, the gameplay was a lot of fun. I enjoyed every aspect of it. Like, there was literally nothing in it that I did not enjoy. Uh, that also, if you guys are wondering, yep, I got myself a PlayStation 4 now. I uh, picked that up last week as well. My little vacation present to myself. Don't know if I mentioned it in the last episode. I may have. I'm not too sure. Um, may have even talked about Uncharted 4 for all I know. Can't keep track of things. I've been... Um, the, the downside to everything that's happened this week is I have been sick as a dog. I ended up catching a stomach bug a couple days ago. Uh, just thought it was, you know, just st stress or whatever it was. Didn't really know at first. Could have been allergies. Could have been anything. Um, and then it just kind of got worse. Um, I haven't really been able to keep any food in for two days now. Um, and it's just been, I, I've been able to, well, not, I can't, I can't eat much of anything except for, oh God, <laughs> uh, toast. Toast and noodles are the only things, like, it's like, um, whenever I get really sick, I can only eat white foods. Like, I don't get that. Like, I don't understand it. Like, white bread and noodles and, like, I can't have any cream or anything, but, like, I just can't have any, yeah, nothing, no, no meats, nothing. It's just, I have to keep, oh, good lord. Okay, so we're in the middle of this battle. Are we getting wrecked by that jerk, too? I think we are. I think we're getting attacked by them both. Whew. Okay, chicken. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay, perfect. Dodge, dip, dodge, dive, and wreck. I'm surprised that we are holding our own as well as we have been. I really hate fighting those guys, because for one XP, they do a lot more damage than they're worth. And we are going to do this real quick. Yeah, so, as I was saying, I've just been sick of the dog. Um, but still streaming in the middle of everything, which is really weird. Uh, I don't know where I'm getting the energy. don't know where I'm finding the energy to do it. Um, even right now, I'm tempted to go and crawl into bed and just kind of call it a day. But I uh, wanted to record this. wanted to get in and play some games. And it, it's funny, oh, because it actually helps a little bit. Um, oh, I wish I had a range thing. That witch is going to be brutal. Can we get in over here? Like, it's, there, it's, just so you're aware, you can be within sight of him, and you just have to be, like, within a certain range. Like, that guy, he, I was in his range, so he started to follow me. So you can kind of kite them away. Uh, insect guards are kind of fun because they are worth a boatload of XP. Uh, they're, I think, 12 or 13, and they're not terribly difficult to battle. Let's get away from that witch, because she, she sees me, she's going to continue to wreck me. I just don't want to see her coming anywhere near me. Yeah, so this is like a fairly decent battle. I like insect guards. They don't do tons and tons and tons of damage, but they they can. Take potion. 
let Kit get in a couple of licks. But I mean, just this battle itself is worth every ounce of it because of fact, like I said, I'll she get 12 or 13. <coughs> Whoa, that was a puke bubble coming up. 12 or 13 uh, XP out of this one. Wow. Yeah, apparently now T's not going to sit well. Oh, good lord. Oh god, take a potion. I didn't realize how close I was to death. Insect guard, you are a, a, a valiant adversary. Oh, Jesus, really? Why? Why did you have to get wrecked in there? So 10 XP. Which means if I kill all of them down there, there should be usually 3 or 5. Um, that should give us our next level. And that in itself is worth it. If you ask me, which you probably weren't. Uh, we're going to have to take on a freaking witch. Right off the bat, laser beams. Really? You little brat. There we go. That was actually much better than I was expecting. Uh, yeah. Let's take him out. Come on, kid. Keep him distracted. We'll, we'll wreck him together. Okay, that's not going to happen. Okay, kit, I'm going to just go over here. Okay, come on. Uh. Okay, so you got to tap it to get the block. I got it. Does it do any damage with that as well? I'll take the XP, though. Like, that's exceptional. Just the amount of XP we've been getting. And this has been phenomenal. So yeah, uh, things are going well. I'm, I'm actually quite happy. Um, I Like I mentioned, my son's birthday on Friday. Loved hanging out with him. Um, just loved the person he's becoming, the man he's becoming. Um, he's, just, he's always been a wonderful person. Uh, but to know that he is a gentle soul attached to that wonderful person just makes me so happy. Um, you know, his mother and I are exceptionally proud that he is our child. Even though I don't live with them, you know, he, he lives in another province halfway across the country from me. I still think of him all the time. He is always in my thoughts. And I adore him immensely. Uh, just so happy and proud. And he's 15 now. So, and um, it's nice too because over the course of the three years and a bit that I've been doing this, um, I've got to see him grow up on the channel as well. I mean, he's been kind of part and parcel to this whole thing. Um, you know, the whole reason, like I've mentioned many, many times, that he's the whole reason I've even started this. Okay. I don't know why we're doing so well, but we are. Um, but yeah, I mean, so I can go back and listen to some of the old recordings and stuff and listen to his, you know, his much younger voice. And now he's got such a deep, manly voice. It's just kind of funny, you know, to to think that, um, you know, this is my child. <laughs> and I adore him. And, and we have a lot of fun. Um... I'm glad that he's at a point where he's into similar style games and stuff that I'm at. Uh, we are talking on Monday of doing some Rainbow Six Siege together, which I've never played. Um, I've had for quite a while. God, if I pause like that again, I'm stopping myself from throwing up. Just so you guys are aware. How dedicated I am to my craft. Um, yeah, that's just rough. Ugh. Uh, what we're doing is we are going to get to our next level. That's the whole process for today. We're at 86. We need 11 more. A, a nice insect guard would be amazing. Uh, we're not going to kill kits. We're going to leave kits alone. Okay, who's wrecking who and why? Oh, there we go. So we got the XP for that. And we're going to get the XP for this. One XP. Uh, seven more. We got this. We got this. We're going to go check out a new biome as well. I mean, we are busy. Busy at this. Uh, again, about the series, uh, very happy. Thank you very much, everybody, for your support on the first episode so far. Um, I've had mixed reviews on the music. Some people like it. Some people don't like music at all. Um, just so you're aware, I always have music in all my Cube World episodes. It's just been my thing. It's part of my, uh, my shtick with it. So I'm going to maintain it. Okay, so Rogue. Uh, this is one thing I am going to do. Anything that's not me, I'm getting rid of. I'm not going to carry it. We'll gather enough coin from everything else that I just don't care. Um, I, I just really don't care at all because of the fact that you, the maintaining stuff in this game is hard enough as it is. Oh, yeah. Uh, had to wreck that. 
Uh, but I mean, I can get enough coin from just doing that kind of stuff, just wrecking fools, and, you know, collecting the bits and pieces. Uh, I don't sell any of that stuff off anyway, so why would I really care? I, I never sell it, so why collect it? So I'm just going to collect stuff for this guy. Unless it's really cool, like gold, we leveled up. How much are we getting for these alpacas? One XP, okay, and two. Uh, let's do this real quick. So we'll do that. Um, so we'll do our pet mastery. I'll do one in each. That should be enough. So this is increasing this power. Uh, well, the cooldown um, is is less. So it, that means that it takes uh, fewer moments for it to get back into effect. I think the only damage you do with it is like the the strength of your 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 attack itself. Oh, the catacombs. Uh, catacombs are usually my memory serves properly. That should be one of those little. Um, yeah, it should be like one of these. There, yeah. And it's red. Shall we? Just to see how freaking horrible and awful it's going to be. Oh, red plus ones, because that's going to be amazing. Oh, rogues. <laughs> Still taking damage. That's how bad it was, is I took damage after the fact. <laughs> okay. So, that being said about that one. Nope. <laughs> Oh, uh, yeah, let's go check out the new biome. We're heading in the right direction. Let's scroll back out a little bit. Uh, if you guys look at the map in the top right-hand corner, right? So you can see the kind of how zoomed in it is. If I zoom in closer here, it gets zoomed in more here. See how big it gets? Um, so if you really want to see a lot more of the map, you can just zoom it in, which is very handy. Uh, I just find it takes up a lot of the real estate. But if you guys like that, I mean, I have no problems trying to keep it out and stuff. I've never really paid much attention to it because I just can just go and zoom in and out on the um, in the map screen. It's not a big deal. But it does look kind of interesting from time to time, especially like right now. That's pretty cool looking. Uh, what do we got over here? What do you got? What you got for me, huh? Did I see you? That's right, I saw you. You're going to give me your 2 XP because it's what you're worth now. Okay, you're worth 1, but still. It was more XP than nothing. So uh, so we are working towards level 3. Yeah, so as I was saying, is like I'm actually quite enjoying being the shield warrior. Um, so it could be this is the thing. We just do the grind. Oh, frig off, Ocean. Uh, we can just do the grind. Oh my god. <laughs> Sharky! Uh, Sharky, if you're still watching, my friend, I won't wreck him. But uh, Lugatar, the big old shark, dude... You are glorious, Lugatar. Who's who's doing what? Are you, were you doing that, Lugatar? Oh, sweet dear God. You are meanie. Oh, man. Come on, let's get in this Hornet fight. Did we get the XP? We did. 7 XP. Hey, Santa. I got a question for you. You want to help me take on this dude? You're just going to run away, aren't you? See, I can't kite him out. Like, he won't follow out of land, like, at all. I mean, I could hit him, but that's it. Oh my god, he just wrecked Kit. Yeah, I, I just hit that just so you guys could see that he wouldn't kite me. I'm not going to take him on, obviously. Uh, let's take a quick go look at our map. Um, see, uh, six one half a dozen of another, doesn't matter. We can just follow this coastline up. Um, I do actually enjoy following the coast. Um, for me, it's a lot of fun to just kind of wander and see. Um, there is a boss battle that's up here, which we might be able to get to. Kind of hard to tell. Um, but this has been fun. I have no idea how long we've been. Um, it could have been five minutes. could have been 20 minutes. could have been an hour for all I know. I just know that I've been having a blast. Uh, it's kind of nice actually restarting off with a new character and, you know, the new mechanics and trying to learn things. You know, because I've been learning that there is blocking that I can do. Uh, skull bulls still scare the hell out of me at an early stage, but I'm going to write, try to wreck one. Because as much as I'm afraid of them, I'm also not afraid. Because I know eventually they'll irk me enough so that I can beat them every single time. Okay, that's not the one. Oh yeah? How do you like that, Skull Bull? You're going to be my boss battle for the day. Okay, you killed Kit. And you're about to wreck my day. And I'm out of potions. And I got 16 HP. Uh, and we're dead. And that was it. 
Oh, that was a blast. Anyway, I'm going to make my potions and call it a day. I do want to thank everybody once again for coming out and hanging out and checking out my channel. If you guys are new, feel free to subscribe. Feel free to uh, leave a comment. I do these episodes every Sunday, every Wednesday, uh, like clockwork. Um, and I do have other things that I post on a regular basis as well. Uh, starting in the, for this entire season as well, if you guys are interested, I'm uploading all these videos to Twitch as well. So they are, uh, I'm going to have all of my Cube World episodes set up as standalone videos on Twitch. I'm going to double dip per se. Um, I, I figure it's always good to have all of your eggs in multiple baskets instead of just one. And I've got no issues promoting myself on both. So if you guys do like my content and you do want to see live streams, I highly recommend that you follow me over on Twitch. That's where the magic happens, per se. Um, still going to maintain everything here on this channel. This is going to be whenever I decide to do a video. Or if I just... Like, the Cube World stuff is always going to be here. Uh, but if I ever get a BMI bonnet and want to do something new and something different, this is where it will happen. Uh, kicking around a couple of new ideas to do uh, that may be seeing the light shortly. Um, I'm also still working on a new channel that is put on a bit of hiatus until I get a couple of other things sorted. But uh, it all comes down on that one to tech. Uh, I just need to get a few more bits and bobs for that. Oh, Kit, you brought us a raccoon, did you? Rickin' rockin' raccoon. Oh, God, this is not going to be good. Um, yeah, raccoons suck. Thank you, Kit, for that. Uh, oh, great, there's another raccoon. I was trying to leave and call it an episode, but I can't do that when I'm getting wrecked by a raccoon. It's just not happening either. I'm going to wreck him, he's going to wreck me. One of us is going down, and um, it's probably going to be me. Or Kit. Kit's going to go down again for sure. Ooh, baby. 11 XP. I think this is a great place to end. Anyway, thank you again, everybody, for all your continued support, and I... We'll see you guys very soon in our next episode. Take care. Bye-bye.